Let's talk about how to add borders or shading to your cells in Microsoft Excel. Let's start with this shading first. So I'm going to highlight the cells uh, in cell A4 to A11. And then I'll pick on the home menu. And for the uh, shading, it's going to be this icon over here that looks like a bucket. It says the word fill there. And I'll click on the pull down. And then what's nice about this is as you move around the colors, it's going to show you what that looks like. So I wouldn't use a dark color here because I can't even see the text now. So I'll use like a light blue. And now those, those cells are shaded light blue. Let's do it again. I'm going to highlight from C3 to K3. Once again, now if I want to use the same color I just used, then I'll click on the bucket itself and then it uses the same color. So when you click on the pull down for the bucket, that's called the fill color or, or the shading. So now let's talk about adding borders onto our cells. In this case, let's say I wanted a, a line above the cells on row 11 so that people can see that those are totals. I'm going to highlight the, row, the numbers in row 11. And now you're looking for the border icon over here. And I'm going to click on the pull down for the border icon. And now you have many borders, borders to choose from. So I'll pick on the word top border which will put a line above the cells. Now, if I click away from those, now you can clearly see the line above those cells. Uh, we made that with a border. Now, let's add borders to some other cells. So, I'm going to highlight from C4 over to I9. And now, I'd like to have borders around all of those cells. Once again, I'm going to click on the pull down next to the uh, border icon over here. And now let's try one that's called All Borders. But notice how there's many choices here. I'll pick on All Borders. And now you can really see lines uh, around all of those cells. And it'll print that way as well. So I'll pick on the File menu and then pick on Print. And you can see how the total line has the line above those cells. That was the top border. And then all of those cells have the, the, uh, the borders around the cells. So you would just highlight the cells that you want and then click on the pull down for the, um, the border here. So that's how, you, and there's many choices there. And then here's the one for the fill color or the shading. So now you know how to do the shading and the border in Microsoft Excel.